What is going on everybody? Dennis the Menace here with Dig Life Crisis. Welcome back to the channel. Alright, today, got a cool little video. It's another polishing video of another one of these really, really super crazy Turkish agate rocks that I recently acquired. Kind of went through hell and back to get a hold of it, but it is finally in the arms of the rightful owner. And it is not polished because all the ones I get from over there are not polished. So... I'm going to do a cool little video. I'm not going to do a video on the whole polishing process, but I am going to show what it looks like now before I get a hold of it. And then I'm going to show some detailed pictures or videos of what it looks like when I'm done. This thing is going to look really crazy. I know I said the last one was the craziest Turkish agate that I had ever seen in my life, but man, this one is like a step up and it's got a whole lot of a whole lot going on inside this rock so whenever it's polished it is going to look insane so i'm going to show you this rock real quick before i get started with it and then i'm going to show you the rock when i'm done so stay tuned this is probably going to be a quick little video so but stay tuned and hit that subscribe button you know you want to <laughs> check this out i'm gonna show you real quick all right i got my little setup here with my trusty makita electric polisher with the diamond pads as usual and check this thing out this is the turkish agate rock right here this thing is insane i know you really can't see too much detail but if you are familiar with rocks and what they look like when they are polished you know that it is going to look way different than what this looks like so but I'm trying to just give you a little little preview what it looks like you see all this stuff going on in there there's stick agate and quartz crystals in there and all kind of stuff little pockets in there and lots of reds blues oranges a little yellow mixed in there little druzy pockets in there i don't know if i can catch that but super cool but just for the record this is what it looks like before so stay tuned i'm about to get on this thing now all right done with that one man look at the shine on that thing i mean unreal see a future in that thing crazy i had to bring it up here where i could show it off because the sun coming through the trees was just not working out but check this thing out man look at those colors the oranges and the blues Mixing with those yellows up here. Man. That's crazy. The craziest. This is the craziest. I thought the last one was the craziest. But this one has it beat, man. Look at the blues with the pink in there. Unbelievable. I don't know how good the camera actually picks up the, the actual colors. But man, that's, look at that in the quartz seam, that yellow, dude, this crazy, dude, so, so crazy looking, there's some minor scratches in there, see that, I don't know, maybe there's something with the pad, might have to check out the pads. But uh, unbelievable color, man. I just wanted to show that one off. Not bad for something that looks like this on the backside. <laughs> Unreal. This is what they look like. They're just orange, brownish, nasty. And goes to the most beautiful rock you've ever seen in your life. That takes an insane polish. Look at that polish. Boom. Man. On to the next one. Alright, man. Here's the second one here. Boy, look at the shine on that thing. Woo! Looks like I'm holding a, holding a little pond. But, man. Look at the colors on this thing. This thing is epic. Let me flip it around here. Look at the colors. The reds and the blues. And that orange, super, super wild looking man. The yellows, even has a little quartz vein running through there. 
Man, that thing is wild looking. It's really hard to hard to record this thing. It's so shiny. <laughs> I had to come up here and sit on my little deck so I could get the light out of it so I could record, man, because it is crazy. Let's see if I can zoom in here. Man. This is one of the craziest agates. I mean, just unbelievable. Looks like a little rose in it over here, a little flower, a little druzy pocket in there. Super wild looking though. Uh, I'll tell you what, man, that this one had scratches all over it whenever I did it the first time. And I went back to 200 grit, started over again, still had the scratches. Man, I had to throw the whole set out. One of those pads had a grain of sand, a grain of sand embedded in it or something, man. Because, wow, I mean, the scratches just would not go away. So, I put the new pads on and knocked it right out of there. Super crazy. But, anyway, just want to show you guys, man, this is crazy, crazy, crazy rock. But, man, what a shine. I mean, unbelievable. Well... That is it for now. I'm glad that I got to share that uh, polishing, uh, that crazy, crazy rock. I call that the Grand Mac Daddy of all turkey agates. So uh, it's definitely one of the crazier ones that I've ever seen. It's the craziest anyway, but uh, that one ain't leaving my collection. I ended up selling that other one for a lot of money, <laughs> but this one isn't leaving my collection. <laughs> but uh, stay tuned, hope you guys liked it. Uh, I like sharing my really cool finds and know are really cool projects that i've that i've you know polish up and all that stuff so stay tuned for the next one subscribe if you haven't and i will see you soon i'm about to get ready to go head out west and record some really awesome videos and find some really cool stuff so stay tuned peace